So just to touch on the reasons for for why the elevating rack um, I think is such a cool feature for the Wooly Bear. So obviously it's it's a narrow wheel, wheelbase, which is awesome for towing and towing around because it just slides right behind your vehicle. It's really easy, but with that narrow wheelbase um, and then you add the normal like factory towers, you get the weight up pretty high. And I always kind of worried about that as far as you know height and low and you see a lot of people have their stuff low on the system well this kind of allows you to have best of both worlds so this is a so this bar is 60 inches this takes it to 64 these are removable though you can mount the tent just directly to this rack if you wanted to the way i have it set up but so 60 64 low so it's super low keeps the low center of gravity when you have weight on the rack and then as you'll see here in a second um, it goes all the way up to 80 for the base and 84 for the rhino rack crossbars, which really allow the awning to work just beautifully. It also gives a brace. So this hard gives a full brace for a nice full size awning as well. So it gets it up really high, I think higher than the factory crossbars as well. I'll have to double check on that. Um, we do have a, for whatever it's worth, we do have a, uh, a lift, the lift kit on this as well. So that, um, that raises everything a little bit as well. So I think it's, it is about 18 inches of ground clearance, um, to the main frame, obviously outside the axle itself. So, um, all right, enjoy the video. All right. So my daughter's holding the camera, six year old, see how this goes. Got some traffic in the background. Oh, <laughs> she's saying hi. Okay. Out of the shop. <laughs> So I've been getting this question for a couple, uh, a little bit now, just exactly how this rack works. So let me show you. All right, come around this side, just so you get a little bit closer up. So the first thing, we have these little pins. We just pull those out really fast, okay? And then there's pins that hold this in place. So we'll start over here. So normally we have a tent on here. So, oh yeah, there you go. So normally we have a tent on there. So this is usually weighted down with, you know, 150 pounds ish. So it's a little bit, you know, it, these gas struts are meant to support that. But even with that, I can still hold it down and I'll, and I'll show you. So, so I'm gonna pull the pin. All right, and I'm just gonna pull down on this a little bit and these slide right out. One, two, I'll leave that one out just a little bit. Come around to this other side, right here. One. Two, I'm gonna just come release this. Now I have these straps, again, just because I don't have the weight holding it down. I have these straps just to hold, so it just doesn't go up all the way on me before the other side's ready. And then we just come over here. Same thing. We go. One, two. Right there. Pull this pin. Three. And last one. I'll just pull the rest of this one out. All right. And then this <laughs> goes up all the way. And I'll come over here and just release these straps. All right. There it is. Fully deployed. These come back in here, one, two, just to hold it in place and out, not going anywhere. So super solid, super solid. Um, well, it goes up, I wanna say about 16 inches. So uh, now it's a nice height, you know, it's, it's not very low, but it's nice, it's a nice height for the awning, all of that stuff. And then the reverse can come right back down, slide these out. And then again, normally there's a lot more weight on here, so it's a lot easier. But but you can see even with that, I can just kind of put some body weight into it. Pop that in. Pop this one in. Sorry about that. My brother is on the trailer. Uh oh, <laughs> this way. We're not done with this video over here. So. I know. All right. And then, same thing over here. One, two. Oop, dropped it that time. 
So again, normally you don't have to actually have to pull down really much at all. It's, it's a nice weight, but there you go, done. So um, ah. something like that. Thank you so much for checking it out. Bye. Oh, and by the way, that my brother.